You said what you singing? I'm gonna smack you. <laughs> and it's Christmas! <laughs> I hate you. Y'all make me sick. That's all right. That's why I can put music on. We'll be. Y'all get on my goddamn nerve. <laughs> You want rubs? Oh, you want rubs. Say good morning to the people. Wanna say good morning? No? Okay. Let me get him situated, guys. It's funny how your body adjusts. It's what, 32 degrees? It feel like a heat wave out here. <laughs> Bananas. But we still got these mounds of snow. And my bubby is still struggling to find this spot. So, we're going to have a walk today. So, he finds some place. So, guys, I'm moving slow this morning. But I'm making me some breakfast late, although more like brunch. But I'm frying my bacon in the air fryer. Yay! 400 degrees, I'm going to say about 10, 11 minutes, halfway. When I showed you before, I just turned it over. And nice, crispy bacon. Yum. Okay, so I showed you guys my purchase from, what's the name of the company again? Grace and Gratitude. Grace and Gratitude Tea, I showed you guys. So... I showed you that I got the tea bags. I'm excited to make my own my own tea bag. So I'm gonna try the green tea. The green tea this morning. Hey baby. And I'm gonna make a tea bag. So the instructions say to take a scoop of the tea. I spill it all over the place but put that in there and then it also said that you can put your sweetener in there too so that you steep it all together so we're gonna take I don't know I guess that would be enough we'll see that's gonna be trial and error and then it says you take this and you flip it over. <laughs> I made a tea bag, guys. So we're gonna give it a try. I'll let you know how it tastes. So, air fried bacon for the win. Nice and crunchy, like I make like it. And no dirty frying pan to clean. And the drippings from the bacon I can use in. Mm, Flavor and food. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yep, that's good. And now it's a thicker cut of bacon. So keep that in mind too. My thought process is a thinner slice of bacon would take less time. Is why I said that. And let's check out our homemade Bad. Come talk to me. Okay. Say hi to Angie. Hi to Angie. Hi, baby. Oh, 
How are you? She said don't talk to him. Oh. Why? She's jealous. Oh. Get out the camera. I see that handsome face. I saw you, Kenny. I saw you. I see you. I, <laughs> I see you. Can I help you? I'm too far away to help you, but I see your handsome face. Hi. Good morning time. What, is it still morning? I don't think so. Good afternoon, morning time. You have enough to get him something to play with? Okay. Okay, so I want to say I like my grits thick and I made them looser for Shelby. She better eat grits or I'm going to be mad because I like, like, spackle. <laughs> so, late start. But I'm going to have my tea and yes check out grace and gratitude and i'll let you know i'm gonna taste it in a few i'm letting it steep bye for now okay guys <sighs> my first tea bag was successful um i will say that i have to play with the the crystals, the sweeten the sugar crystals to get it the way that I want it. I wound up adding some um simple syrup that my lemon simple syrup that my girlfriend made for me. Um but this is the green tea, it has strawberry, papaya, hibiscus, raspberry leaves. This is good. This is good. So grace and is it grace and gratitude? I think it's graceandgratitude.com, I think. I'll tag. Thanks, Dana. golden sun me a name i call myself far a long long way to run so a needle pulling thread <laughs> la a note to follow so tea a drink with jam and bread that would bring us back to Day 20. Alrighty, guys. My reef is just about naked. And let's see what's in here today. Come on. Come to mama. Come on. Okay. All right. Just a nice neutral... Let's see what the name is. Can I get it out? There it is. Let's see. Let's see. Come on. Cooperate. It said pink clay. Oh, yeah. I guess it is. Couldn't really see it next to the orange. But pink clay is this color for day 20. Let's go see what Madeline Tosh has. When you know the notes to sing, you can sing most anything. 
Ooh. Ain't I? Sorry, guys. I could watch the sound of music over and over. That's pretty. That's really pretty. Very pretty. Have you guys seen anyone that's making the cow? I saw one person, I think, that's like keeping track of the project while as they open each day. As promised, the sweater is flying off. I have now gotten back to where I'm joined in the round. And then I'm just going round and round until I get to the length. I think this pattern calls for a cinched in waist it kind of blouses. And I think that emphasizes my pouch. So I don't think I'm going to do that part. I think I'm going to just let it go straight. I'm thinking about splitting and making the hem a little longer in the back. We'll see. All right, guys. I said I was going to swatch these uh, these lip creams from Fenty. Now, I use these normally. I think I said that to you before, but they're just a gloss. Now, these are a bit creamy. The packaging is the same. It just says creamy on it, so they're a little bit... Which one is this? Lord, I can't see. This is the Honey Waffles. This is the one that I really wanted to see. So, I'm going to put it on... Yeah, the glare you can't see. I think that's gonna be nice. Let's see, guys. Mm hmm. I like that. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. So that is the honey waffles. Now, I normally wear a liner it's out of habit. And I really think this is going to be my new go to. Mm hmm. I like. I like, I like, I like, I like. So let's try. That was the honey waffles, which was the one I really was interested in. And then the other one that I really thought would be nice is this cookie jar, which is a little darker. I like that they're buildable. So with the second application, you get a little more color payoff. And I like that one too. And I think that's gonna be nice with my liner, yeah. I like it, guys. I like it. I like it. I like it. So that is the cookie jar. So just to kind of give you guys an idea. 
Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I like. Mm-hmm. So let's try. This fruit snacks is really, <clears throat> really a deep, like, berry. And let's see. Yep, I like them all, guys. And they are not sticky. They feel like a lip gloss, but the color payoff is a little bit more than just a tint, if you will. Mm -hmm. This one is fruit snacks. I like, I like, I like. And the last one is Fenty Glow which I actually think is going to be too light for me. So let's see. Tomorrow when I put some clothes on, I'll get, I'll get cut you for you guys and you guys can see. So the Fenty Glow is really like a natural... Not bad. Not bad at all. I think I'm pleased with all four. Mm -hmm. I like. They all can serve a purpose. Again, I, ha I, I love a liner just to make the edges of the lip a little darker. And I have a nice uh, deep wine liner that I think will look nice with this one. I can't find it right now, but it's MAC 2, and it's a deep... I forget the name of it, but I think that'll work. So, yeah. As promised. As promised. But I think of all of them, it's a... It's a... Mm, a mock-up between of which ones I like the best. So let's see. So this is how I would normally wear it. Let's do honey waffle. So I normally line my lips first <clears throat> and then apply. I think this one is the most natural of them all. What do you guys think? They really feel good, though. I don't like a sticky um, lip gloss. This is very moisturizing and smooth on the lips. It's not heavy or light. I like it. I do that trick to keep the lipstick or gloss off the inside of the lips. Therefore, it doesn't get on your teeth. I have to remember to do that lately. I've had pictures with lipstick on my teeth. But I'm pleased. I think I did um, a good job by getting all four. But I honestly think... 
between this one and the cocoa jar. Like these are the colors that I would normally have on. And if I wasn't going to actually put on a lipstick since we don't go anywhere, <laughs> I, I would probably wear this one more often. Me tinks, me tinks, but we'll play and we'll see. We shall see. But as I promised, I wanted to swatch them so you guys can see. So these are the new Fenty Gloss Balm Creams. They, wait, do I have the Gloss Balm in here? Just so you guys can see. Do I not have one in here? I usually keep one. No, I don't have one, but I have a clear gloss balm, the Fenty Glow I have in a gloss balm. I have a dark one, a chocolatey one. Like I, I keep them and it's just, that's really just a gloss with a real faint amount of tint in it. And I can't, oh yes, here's one. See, here's the clear one that I normally wear with a liner. Same thing. This is my everyday kind of go-to just to keep the lips from looking crusty. <laughs> so that was that, guys. As promised, I wanted you to see. And I'm pleased. I like all four of them. But of them, I think the honey waffle and the cookie jar would be the ones that I would wear most often. So there's that. And it's late. It's like 9.30 now. I am probably going to knit until I get sleepy. I need to write up my newsletter for tomorrow, my Monday mood, and I'm going to do that right now before I forget. And then I think I'm going to say goodnight to you guys, and um, Monday, the last Monday before Christmas, I still need to wrap Shelby's gifts. Good night.